So my grandfather, Bob Clemens, started Clemens Boats here at this location in 1966. I've heard of countless times where he slept on the couch in the reception area overnight trying to keep the business afloat. Within a very short period of time, I'm gonna say probably about 10 years, was one of the number one dealers in Ohio. He took Clemens Boats to be the actual number one dealer for Bayliner Boats in the mid 80s. Grandfather turned it over to my father and my uncle, and they just kept up with the tradition, kept growing the business, adding different aspects of the business, and then that brings us into 2014, which is when I've had my chance to take over the business and put my touches on it. I spent a lot of time with my grandfather fishing for smallmouth bass in his boat, and me and my father and his friends would fish every Thursday from the time I was three years old all the way up till the time I could run a boat myself. A lot of my best memories are, are fishing on the lake with my family. So, you know, Lake Erie to me just means, uh, in one word, would be freedom. When you're out on the water, the cell phones go away, the iPads go away, you know, the hustle and bustle of life goes away. You can relax. I don't know if being born around the water just implants it as part of your being, but for me, being away from the water is not an option. So I think one of the best parts of this area is the fact that you can be on vacation not far away from your home. You know, you can boat to Cedar Point, you could go to the park all day, you could stay the night there, then you could get up in the morning and go tubing in the bay, and then you could go to an island to have lunch, and then you could go walleye fishing after that. You could spend a week here and not do the same thing twice, all within close proximity of the Marblehead, Sandusky, Fort Clinton area. Having a smaller family-owned business doesn't just mean something to the employees and me, it means something to a customer when they walk in the door. And that's something we never want to lose no matter what happens in the future. We know our customers, we text back and forth, we have normal conversations outside of business. So, you know, my goal is to be number one, not necessarily in, in dollar amount, but in customer relationships and reviews and customer satisfaction and just get as good as we can get as a family-oriented dealership.